फाइव प्लेनेट के इस वीडियो में आपका बहुत बहुत स्वागत है एंड वील बी सॉल्विंग एक्सरसाइज सिक्स पॉइंट टू ऑफ चैप्टर लाइन एंड एंगल्स ऑफ क्लास नाइन सो वी हैव अ फिगर हेयर एंड वी नीड टू फाइंड द वैल्यूज ऑफ एंगल एक्स एंड वाई एंड वी ऑल्सो नीड टू प्रूव दैट लाइन ए बी इज पैरल टू सी डी सो सिंस दीज टू एंगल्स आर वर्टिकली अपोजिट टू ईच अदर दैट मीन्स वी कैन से दैट वाई इज इक्वल टू वन हंड्रेड एंड थर्टी डिग्री and now that y is equal to 130 degree and cd is a straight line so that means this particular angle is 50 degree and since our ray is also a straight line that means angle x is equal to 180 degree minus 50 degree and that is equal to 130 degree so in this figure transversal is intersecting the two lines ab and cd such that the alternative angles are equal to each other and hence we can say that ab and cd are parallel to each other now let's move on to the question number 2 so this is the figure in question number 2 and the given is that line ab is parallel to cd and cd is parallel to ef so that means all these three lines are parallel to each other now since these two angles are vertically opposite to each other that means these two angles will be equal to each other And since CD and EF both are parallel to each other, so that means the interior angles on the same side of the transversal will be basically supplementary angle. And hence we can say that the summation, the addition of these two angles is equal to 180 degree. So we can say that Y plus Z is equal to 180 degree. And in the equation, it is also given that Y is to Z is equal to 3 is to 7. So with this, we can find out the values of y and z let's assume a common ratio between y and z as k and that means 3k plus 7k is equal to 180 degree and the value of the k is equal to 80 degree so therefore the value of y is equal to 54 degree and the value of z is equal to 126 degree now let us find out the value of x now that line ab and cd are parallel to each other we can say that x plus y is equal to 180 degree and this is because x or y dono hi transversal ke same side par interior angles and they will be a pair of supplementary angles isliye hum log keh sakte hain ki x plus y is equal to 180 degree and we already have the value of y and that is why x is equal to 180 degree minus y y की वैल्यू यहाँ पर पुट कर देते हैं और x का वैल्यू निकाल लेते हैं सो दिस हाउ वी हैव कंप्लीट क्वेश्चन नंबर टू और लेट्स मूव ऑन टू दी नेक्स्ट वन चलिए तो इस क्वेश्चन को देखते हैं क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री को एंड वी हैव लाइंस हियर सच दैट ए बी इज पैरल टू सी डी और जो हमारी लाइन ई एफ है दैट इज पर्पेंडिकुलर टू लाइन सी डी नाउ इट इज गिवन इन दी क्वेश्चन दैट एंगल जी ई डी इज इक्वल टू हंड्रेड एंड दैट्स वाई वी कैन इजिली फाइंड आउट एंगल जी ई एफ And that's equal to 126 minus 90 degree. Now, since AB and CD are basically parallel to each other, that means we can say that these two angles are supplementary to each other. And hence, this the value of this angle is equal to 180 degree minus this particular angle. And we get the answers here. Now, since AB is a straight line, we can say that angle AGE and angle FGE, the summation, the addition of these two angles is equal to 180 degree. So we can easily find out the value of angle FGE. So this is how we have solved this question. Now let's move on to the next one. 